Hi guys, this is Level Crossing Fan here and I'm at the MacArthur Street Level Crossing in Soldiers Hill and they are installing a new safe train type 3 bow at this crossing to replace a dead one. So they were testing the crossing early and I was down here and yeah, so the safe train type 3 bow on the signal which they're working on now it was dead. But yeah, it turns out they're installing a new one I think. I might be just trying to fix it up. I don't know though. But yeah, it's an interesting sight to see. So this may take a while for them to do, see, so they're installing the wiring right now. So yeah, in there's the safe train type 3 bell, which was the dead one. So that's been replaced with a new one. So I think it's an older model one because of the base it has, but I can't tell. Oh here, we, no it's a newer model because it's got that newer style base, but it's a newer safe train type 3 bell. But yeah, it's a bit upsetting to see another safe train type 3 bell being installed and not like something different such as a general signal Z bell or like a safe train type 3 but they are now going to pull the test switch button soon to make sure this make sure it works but yeah he's just bolting it on right now so I'll get a side view of the signal but yeah this is a very interesting sight to see I'm having a lucky day today I think that guy's doing some works on the gate mech over there. But yeah, so this one would have been, they would have um, bought it, for, they would have purchased it, because I can tell how shiny it is. But yeah, still, it's a shame another safe train type 3 has been put up and, to us for our fans, since they're very common. And yeah, just, it's a shame too. But yeah. It's just what they line decides so. though. Yeah, this is a very interesting sight. I'm stunned about it. Because, yeah, I did tell them about this and, yeah, they agreed on it. So, there you go. So, there's the new safe train type 3 bell up on that signal. It's a new purchase. I can tell how shiny it is. I'll get a close up of it. But here we go, they're ready to test the crossing. It's me. We'll see if this bell works. Just opening the test switch cabinet now and it's just wait for the cars to go by. So the older safe train type 3 bell, which would have been here, would have been like recycled from when this crossing had the old signals with like the safe train gate mech on this. No, it was a Westinghouse EB gate mech on this signal and safe train one on the other side. And it also had normal cross bucks. I'll come up to the signal to see if it's working. Sorry, Fred. Yeah, it's not working. I can hear the bell on the other side, but this one is still silent. They're going to have to do a bit of work on it. But yeah, lucky day I'm having today. I just can't believe it. Here we go. Pu push the test switch button back in. The boom gates have gone up again. So yeah, they've got a bit of, they've got a bit more wiring work to do. But yeah, I'm surprised they installed another state trend type 3 bell because they do have a high fail rate to them. And also the screws allow water to leak in like those general signals type ones, the unadjusted and adjusted ones. Which make sure I use the adjusted type ones and not the unadjusted type ones. So yeah, there's the safe train type 3 bow in there. So they'll put that into storage in their yard over there. Where they put a lot of rail stuff into storage. I'll probably get that working again at some point. But yeah, I still can't believe they've installed a new safe train type 3 bell. Because yeah, they're very boring because yeah, too many of them around Australia, such as Victoria and South Australia, they're very common. It's just not fair. Just wish we had different varieties like Western Cullen Hazy bells. But yeah, it's just what they like, as per usual. So yeah, over there, the 
doing some work to the real eye box. So yeah, they'll probably get all the wiring ready for the new safe train type 3 bell there. Okay, now, so they're coming back over to try get this new safe train type 3 bell to work. But yeah, those guys have just got to know them well because I've seen them at the Gilly Street crossing before when they were like cleaning the lights and gate lights. But yeah, very interesting sight, I can't believe it. So yeah, it looks like he might be doing some wiring work. But we'll get a side view across on the other side of the tracks. Come across here. You can see. So I think he's unbolting it from the pole now. Because you can see he's undoing the screws. I'll just get a close up there, zoom in. Can't believe what's happening. It's a very interesting sight. Just having a lucky day. So yeah, about these van line workers also, they were testing the crossing earlier and they let me pull the test switch button because yeah, they've just gotten to know me well because I've seen them at the Gilly Street crossing before and I've told them that I like level crossings. So yeah, I'm just surprised. I'm having a lucky day today. But anyway, focusing on a bit closer to the road right now. So yeah, it looks like he's just going through the wiring right now. It's a lot of work. over there still works so they're not going to be replacing that one so that one was would have been like still there would have been reused when they installed these signals in 2016 because the original signals as i said before this one had a safe train roof gate mechanism and this one had a westinghouse ev gate mechanism and they had the normal railway crossing signs as well without the red backgrounds but yeah work he's doing. Just, and there we go, my camera's focusing again. Okay, here we go, so I'm putting it back on the pole. Just got to screw it on, so it's nice and tight and stays on. Okay, he's gonna, that guy's over there, he's going to pull the test switch button. Right. Yeah, here we go. It's work. It's working now. Just go to quick pull and push back in. But yeah, that is working now. Come up to the signal now, just so I can have a listen to it. Sure is an interesting sight, I tell ya. So yeah, unfortunately I didn't get footage of me pulling the test switch button. I wanted to though, but they just said to pull it. It doesn't bother me though. So I was just locking up the door for the um, power box there, or the relay box. So there we go, it's installed. There's just some wiring there. Ah oh, no, it must be from that remote thing. Here we go, it's gonna pull the button now. Here we go, it's working. So 
it sounds to the gates rise, same with that one over there. And there we go, it's, boom gates are going back up because he pushed the test switch button in. But there we go, that new safe turn type 3 bell works. So yeah, it does look like they're all done now, so they've done a good job. So I first came here to test the crossing. So I tested, they told me they tested the Crescent Road one also. And yeah, so now they've replaced the safe tran the dead safe tran type three bell with a new one. Yeah, now they've all pretty much all done. So the ladder's just gonna be put back into the truck. But yeah, it's been an interesting sight what I've seen. But a lucky day. Okay guys, they are now all done, so they are leaving the crossing. But anyway, hope you enjoyed the video of the Safe Train Type 3 Bell being placed with a new one. It was a very interesting sight to see indeed. I enjoyed it. And I'll see you all later. Bye!